Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. And if you've been here before, welcome back. Thank you for watching my video. So today's video, I'm going to share to you how I drill my pots or some ceramic pots that I got from secondhand shop. So I have a samples here that I did before. So these pots here in front of us are some pots or some secondhand stuff that I got from secondhand shop. I'm going to give you a closer look. So guys, these are the pots that I drilled before. So all of these uh, ceramic pots that I use here are from the secondhand shop. So I have this one here. And if you can see, there is a hole underneath. So I drill a hole in this using a diamond drill bit. So see how beautiful is that? Take the tag name. So this is Haworthia Hybrid. If you look at it, it it's so beautiful in this secondhand ceramic um, I think this is for like a casserole or a pie and I got this one from the second hand shop and I use it to plant my Haworthia hybrid. So see how beautiful is that? And then I also have this one here. This is just new. I just potted this one a month ago. And I cannot really tip it because there is, I put some um, top dressing. I put some top dressing. So it's hard to tip to show you the hole that I made in here. So yeah, this is also from a secondhand shop. Ceramic pots. And I also have this one here. So I just wanna show you what you can do the secondhand stuff that you can get it from your uh, clo uh, close by secondhand shop. So see how beautiful is that? And all these are drilled and has a hole. And I also got this beautiful one here. This one. If you look at it, it's so beautiful. I know they are like very small um, pots, but they are so cute. Now, enough of showing. <laughs> So those are the, all the samples that I can share it to you. So now this time I'm going to show you how I drill my ceramic pots, secondhand ceramic pots. The first thing to do is, you will drill a hole like this. Yeah. 
Now we already make a hole in there, small hole. So what we're going to do is we have to put a water. So we have to wet it. And then we can already drill it dry like this. our first hole so yep so make sure you hold your part well because if you don't you don't hold it you might uh, accidentally um, let it go. I got a beautiful pot here that I got from Kmart, but there's no hole. So I'm going to drill a hole in this. We'll still put water. Make a little slit in there for our drill bit to hold. So let's continue drilling. first layer so I think this will be a little bit thicker so we put water just dry That's why you hold your pot tight or else it will let it go. So here, we successfully made a hole without breaking our pot. Uh, you can use a soil that is specialized for succulent and cactus but what I have here is just a general patty mix I just put some perlite and some pinus so let's put soil
So here we go guys, we just finished uh, doing our project. So we drilled the pot that we use or the container that we use for our succulent and they look beautiful. Going to show you a closer look. So I hope this will inspire you to use some of your old kitchen stuff that you're not anymore using it. It will, this will be good for a birthday present or Mother's Day present or even a Christmas present for your friends and family. So look how cute this one is. And we also have this. And see how beautiful is that? Do you think that will be a good present for a friend or maybe a family member that loves succulent? Who would talk an old stuff that you're not anymore using is you can use it in your succulent. It looks so beautiful. And we have this one here. This is beautiful. So this is just an ordinary succulent. It's like uh, it is a jelly bean type. But look, it becomes so classy and beautiful when you put it in a pot like this. I'll be happy to get a present or birthday present if someone will give me like these ones. And this one. So this pot is from Kaima. It's only five dollars. And just drill a hole and put your favorite succulent type. Maybe use use a, a succulent that you know represent like a hair. So I, that's why I chose this one. looks beautiful in this especially if this grow more lush and bigger and bushy this will be beautiful in this part so what do you think guys did you like today's video or today's project so I hope this video inspires you guys and don't throw your old stuff away use it to plant your succulent your favorite succulent and you can use it for a birthday present or a present for your friends or family that loves succulent as well so that's it for today guys if you like this video please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that every time i have a video like this you will be notified and you will not miss a thing and please do share and like my channel and support my channel Thank you very much for watching my video and I'll see you next time. Bye!